Hello and welcome to Let's Play Beneath the Still Sky with me, Mr. Muck Luckable. In the last episode, we went for a little bit of shopping. We visited Travel Co. and Anchor Insurance. Anchor Insurance was a bit dodgy, but from Travel Co. we got a nice ticket for a tour. Um, but being so kind and generous, we gave that to Gilbert Lamb. Oh look, there he is. Hey, Lamb. And in return, we got a tour of his factory. Or, we're going to get a tour of his factory. Um, Never mind. Oi, I want the tour now. Show me the tour. Show me the money. No, okay, well... Oh, okay, let's go up then. Yep, I'll come with you. <gasps> Close I the can't open... Close the door on me, you rude, rude... Well, he is a rude man, actually. But yeah, hopefully this... No, oh, <laughs> we can't use the elevator because it's in use. <laughs> I didn't think the game has to be that realistic. Come on. There we go. Hopefully this will prove useful. Come on, Joey. The, uh, the tour around the factory. Um, well, it must be useful, otherwise I wouldn't be doing it, would I? So, there we go. We'll try and meet Lamb upstairs. Not, <laughs> not upstairs, up the elevator. And see where the tour takes us. There's still quite a lot going on down there, where we've just left. Like, with that weird, mysterious man, the rude man... Burks, biosurgery. We we still have a lot to do down there, but let's. Oh, what's that? Ah, yes, I forgot about that. Yes, we can click that cable. A loose cable. Now that could be very useful. Yeah, let's take it. I can't reach the cable. Joey. Joey. Yes. Fancy doing some welding, Joey. You bet. I want some action. Who's the victim? You can't go using your welder on people. Oh yeah? Who says? Mm. Asimov's laws of robotics. Maybe Anchor wasn't That's wrong. fiction, Foster. It's just something some guy made up. It's sound moral sense. Maybe we do need robot insurance. Anyway, what I had in mind was that cable. This sounds like a job for Captain Welder. Oh, okay, no sound there. <laughs> Let's get out of the way then. And then you can do it. Can you try welding? Sure. Just keep out of... It's alright, I'm out of the way, you stupid little moany robot. Oh, sorry, sorry, Captain Welder. Uh, oh, well, that's dropped down there, hasn't it? Okay, well, we'll get that later. Where's Lamb? Where are you, Lamb? Are you in your own factory? You should be. You should be managing. Ah, oh, there you are. Let's take this tour. Hey, Lamb. When do I get the tour you promised me? Well, there's no time like the present. Aye, lad. We'll start right now. Now, take a look at this machine. Okay. This machine measures the internal board of the pipes. Accurate to 20 decimal places, whatever that means. Oh, man. Impressive, isn't it? All those numbers. I'm sure they mean something. And he's supervisor? Follow me. I'll show you the next section. Okay. Um. Really don't think he's very good at his job, though. Just saying it now. Oh, what's going on here? What's, what's he, he's going to see the broken pipes. The, the gears. <gasps> This machine is supposed to drive the conveyor, but it's not bloody working. Bloody Edge right. Edge will roll for this. Oh dear. Foreman Potts, why is this machine stopped? Stuck? I've been so busy I didn't notice. Liar. Can't I trust you with anything? Look after my desk, Potts. I'll have to leave you to show yourself around. Was that the tour over? That was a pretty crummy tour. As far as tours go, that was a bad one. Now... Excuse me. Oh, his name's Potts. He's got a name now. He's not just man. Oh, good. Aren't you going to mend the conveyor? That's not my job. My job is to record figures. But everything stopped. My clipboard still works. But what about the pipes? What pipes? The ones on the conveyor belt. That's a special order. And I can't talk about it. Top secret, huh? That's right. 
Haven't we heard that before? I'm getting deja vu here. Mind if I look around? Since you're a friend of Lamb's, you can go where you like. But I'd stay clear of the reactor if I was you. Unless you're wearing some protection. Okie dokie, I think he'll let us go past here now. Let's have a look. Oh yes. Before he blocked us. <gasps> There's Anita. Hello, Anita. Uh, oh, okay, um... What are you doing now? Checking for cracks with x-rays. You shouldn't be here without a protective suit. You're not wearing one. Lamb told me I didn't qualify. As I'm a D-Link, and a woman. A D-Link? What is, what is all this link status about? Because we've been hearing quite a bit about that. What's a D-Link? D-Link is the lowest social category. When your link status is zero, you forfeit all rights and your freedom to move back the city. How come you didn't know that? I'm an outsider from the Gap. So it's you security you're after. No. You won't get far without an ID card. Shush. Ah, I managed to find one. I bet it won't get you to ground level though. No. You'll need a link status of eight or more. Right, okay, lots of information there. What the hell, link status? Um. I have to get to ground level. Look, I really sympathize with you. I could give you my jammer. What's a jammer? What's a jammer? Bypass software. Highly illegal. It gets you past the retina scan to security files. Oh, we need that. That's a start. Can you let me have the jammer? Give me your ID card. Okay, okay, okay. Have it. Take it. There. Here's my card. Thanks. This won't take long. What are you doing? Downloading the jammer to your card. There, it's done. Wonderful. Don't worry, I'll fix everything. You're taking a huge risk. No problem. I'll get us both back on Link's files. Oh, I see. I was, I was just about to ask what is the problem. Like, I'll fix what problem? But we want to help Anita, because she's lovely. Okay. What's so special about these pipes? I'm not sure, but the dimensions of the bore must conform to precise specifications. All that effort for a bit of plumbing? It's suspicious, isn't it? Mm, Perhaps they're quite. part of a giant weapon. Oh, come on, that's a bit far-fetched. Uh, oh dear, we're going to try and hit on that already. We waste no time as Robert Foster. Uh, let's, let's ask, before we do that, let's ask these. How come you were made a D-Link? I was caught hacking into Link. Why did you do that? There are areas in Link space used by security. I was trying to discover what they're up to. Everything's very, 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 very fishy with this Link. What do you mean by Link space? The word inside the computer's memory. The abstract projection of Link's circuits and data banks. That sounds awesome. Will the jammer get me into Link space? No, the only access is through the special interface. There's just one little problem. You'll need to get a Schreiberman port. What the hell is a Schreiberman port? How do I get a Schreiberman port? Well, you'll have to undergo surgery. I need that like I need a hole in the head. The Schreiberman port is a hole in the head. <laughs> oh, surgery. I wonder where we could go to get some surgery done. Hmm. Um so many questions we are really grilling her does link have any internal security they'll be foils naturally what are they intrusion foil programs are they dangerous well standard ifps are simply deterrents but some high level foils can be lethal oh no 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 we don't want that all right finally we're ending ending round and, and getting to the end of the right let's just ask this let's go what do you know about the council it was one of the council who came up with a plan to bond his mind with Link. And ever since then, things have been getting weird. Oh, goodness. Bonding mind. Humans and robotic cyborgs. This this, this never, never ends well. Okay, finally, let's hit on her. How are you doing? What are you doing after work? What do you have in mind? Well, an evening at the theatre? A walk by the lake in the moonlight? And to finish, a candlelit supper. Sounds great. 
But first I'll have to get decontaminated. Another time, perhaps. What's your opinion of Lamb? I'm a D-Link. I'm not entitled to an opinion. But to be honest, I think he's a turd. Hmm, yes, turd, quite. See you later. See you later, alligator. Okay, um... That was a lot of inf information to take in there. But let's just, let's just quickly recap. We have a jammer to get past the retina scan on the terminals. Um, we need to get a Shreedman port from Burke's biosurgery, it seems to kind of get into this Link space, which is an abstract representation of the internal components of Link, and Link is a thing that has been a man melded with machine, and oh goodness, that's a lot of stuff. <laughs> that's a lot of stuff. Let's just, let's just go, we'll we find out, I'm sure. I feel an overwhelming urge to open these lockers. Well then, let's do it, why not? Haha, open. Open. Oh, coat hanger. And I've got a discrepancy. Nothing interesting in this locker. What's she saying? <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, who, who's that? Hello. What's your job? <coughs> I can't hear what you're saying. <coughs> it's a waste of time talking to you. I think it is. <coughs> You're wasting your breath. Okay, yeah, but bye. Um, weirdo. Confirmed. Fluctuation normal. Weird sound effects crossing over there. Um, I don't really want to go in there without a suit. Uh, let's, let's do this. <laughs> Bit cheaty, really, but let's let's now go in there and see what is behind the big danger sign. Okay, well we can survive it seems. Uh, look at the big door. It's the entrance to the react. <laughs> the, <laughs> the people in the other room are, are talking over us. It obviously doesn't open manually. No. Uh, okay, I guess we control that door with this control panel. That makes sense. There's a small monitor screen and some knobs. Now, let's see what's on here. Uh, display reactor status. Open reactor door. Don't really want to open the reactor door. I think we would die. Um, and initiate shutdown procedure. Let's have a look at the status. Oh, jeez oh my. Um, yeah, I don't know what any of this means. <laughs> uh, danger exposure to zeta radiation. Yeah, we're not going in there. No way, Jose. Let's go back and let's see what three is. Damn. I thought we could get past retina scans. Oh. What was it again? Initiate shutdown procedure. That's quite a big thing. I wouldn't be surprised if we can't do that. Let's just quickly try the, with the card. Nope. Okay. Alrighty ho then. Um, I guess we need to go to Burke's oh, biosurgery. Yeah. Check. I have a feeling... Um, we will need to come back here. I think we do need to open that door, but first we need to... Oh, what's that? Oh, I don't care. Um, but first we need to get that suit that that man is wearing. Uh, we don't really want to go in there unprotected, otherwise we will die. Oh, and also we've got to pick up that cable that we welded off. Well, that uh, Captain Welder <laughs> welded off earlier on. That should have dropped down to the lower level, hopefully. So, oh hello Lamb, hello, how are you doing? Let's go down and, let's visit Burks, we have enough time, let's... It's a standard card sl Yeah, that's why I asked you to use it. We have enough time to visit Burks Biosurgery, I think. Now go in, thank you. Um... Sorry, I was just checking the time and stuff there. Aha, there is the cable. Let's grab that. That will be very useful. I think. I don't know exactly what for, though. The cable is made up of many strands of wire and appears to be very strong. Right. That. That's interesting. Maybe we need to make some kind of... I don't know. What would you make with a cable? 
anything, really. I've watched enough Ray Mears and Bear Grylls to know that with some strands of bamboo, no, what is it, the, the tree bark, you can do almost anything. Alright, Burke's Biosurgery. Can we... Oh wait, we couldn't get in there before because we hadn't made an appointment. Oh damn. I hope the stupid projection woman will let us in. Morning, pixelated boobs again. <laughs> Too late. Uh, let's see what she says. Yeah, there we go. I want a Shriebman port. Your name, please? Robert Foster. There's little chance of seeing the doctor. What? Why not? I have instructions not to disturb him. Unless you wish to pay cash, of course. Oh, I see how it is. Uh, I do not want to... No, come back. It's a holographic projector. Can anyone else supply the port? Oh, no. The service is unique to Dr. Burke. Oh, come on. Let me in, you stupid... Stupid thing. Oh. I'm just looking. Please take one of our... I've looked at the brochures, thank you very much. Open this door. It's as immovable as a stain on my conscience. Oh, dear. Um... Hmm... What do we have that we can... Oh, you know what we... Alright, obviously we can't do that yet. For some reason we can't go see... Burke. Which sucks. What, what do you have to say? Do you have anything new to say at all? Where can I get a Shriebman port? What's that? Oh god. An interface which allows humans to talk to computers. Like a mouse, you mean? No, it's a surgically implanted slot. Say, I've heard of those things. Oh, good. They give them to perverts, don't they? Oh. Are you a pervert? Certainly not. Well, you sure look <sighs> like one. Alright, I really do wish we could use violence. I really, really do. Oh. Um, what was I? What was I about to say? What was the other thing we could do? Oh, the terminals. The terminals. That's right. Where did I see one? I think it was outside Anchor Insurance. There was a terminal. Let's go see what we can do with our new jammer on the card, and then we'll probably call it the end of the episode. Let's have a quick look. So many things to do now. It's like we—it's going nice and slow, and then now, bam! We've got Link Space and and getting a Shriebman port and the radiation and all that stuff. We are a busy man, Robert Foster. Let's use this. Okay, so we should be able to do four now. Oh yes, look at that. We're, we are in. Let's have a look at the special security services. Briefing. Oh. It looks like they're encrypted. To me, that seems like some kind of I thought the jammer was supposed to unjam them. <laughs> oh. What about the other one? I bet this is going to be the same, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So, re no, what was the other one? Briefing and report doesn't seem to work. We obviously have to do something else before we can read those. Uh, let's try special operations. File adjustment. <gasps> oh, ho, 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 here we go. Lamb. Gilbert, Bellevue Gardens 2291, balance of account $34,950, and he has a link status of 3, quite high up then, well, if the highest is 8, he's just under half, so let's, uh, let's freeze his assets, <laughs> you have nothing, and let's also authorise D-Link, you are now 0, sorry lamb, but you are an evil man and no one likes you. That's quite that's quite funny. I like that. So, okay, maybe a bit immoral, but I'm sure that is for the greater good. Well, hopefully. So, with that, I think we're probably caught in the episode. Um, next time, <laughs> I think we should go see what Lamb has to say about his uh, recent uh, link status change. And maybe that will lead somewhere. So, until then, thank you for watching, and goodbye. <laughs>